what's up guys it's cypher we've got a season four leak video to talk about some very important season four things we have some information now uh thanks to hypex and Tabor hill link to their channels in the description down below they've got some trusted sources feeding them some information they've been pretty on point in the past so let's jump into it if you guys like these videos do me a solid favor hit that like button and if you're not subscribed to this channel what are you doing hit that subscribe button right now also, if you want to support me even more, you can use my creator code CypherPK in the item shop. Season four is one week away, guys, and there are no confirmed delays at all. We're on track. It's going to be the first season. Season three is going to be the first season this chapter where there is not a huge delay. Let's jump into season four and what we know so far after I eliminate this player. G, G. Oh, a little purple. Okay. What we know so far is that it's rumored to be a superhero theme. Okay. Not just superhero. We're talking Marvel superheroes. Like all the Marvel superheroes. You know, Epic has done work with Marvel and with DC and with all kinds of different collaborations. Like this shouldn't come as a surprise that they're about to drop a entire Marvel battle pass according to the leaks that we have um, from HypeX and Tabor Hill. So this is actually very interesting because chapter one season four actually had a superhero theme as well. You guys remember the battle pass from chapter one season four was a superhero battle pass. However, we don't know those superheroes. They're no name superheroes. They're just superheroes that Fortnite made up and kind of those superheroes kind of resembled you know, you had the Wonder Woman skin, but those weren't real superheroes. They were, those were just Fortnite heroes, those Fortnite characters, not real characters. Um, so this time around in chapter two, Epic is basically flexing how much they've improved with their capabilities to make these uh, collaborations happen. It seems like they're about to drop an entire Marvel season battle pass with the secret skin being Wolverine, okay? that is what we know so far okay so with this knowledge season four seems to be very interesting we've already talked about in previous videos about the comic book section that's coming to fortnite uh galactus and uh thor potentially fighting maybe a little event i think end of season event is going to be marvel themed or at the very least, the start of the next season is going to be Marvel themed. So we might see some sort of in-game Fortnite event where something from the comics will happen um, or our own twist on the Marvel Universe in Fortnite. Um, already, a lot of people, from what I've seen, uh, some people are very excited, obviously. This is a pretty huge, huge uh, story that we're going to have a full Marvel theme. And some people are not too excited. Some people are like, man, what happened to just Fortnite seasons where it's Fortnite skins and a Fortnite themed battle pass? You know, people are some people are tired of these collaborations. The thing is, like, especially with like the secret, the secret skin, people want Fortnite secret skins. But dude, I can't remember the last time I saw. I can't remember the last time I saw the uh, like the it, the visitor or one of those other season skins that have existed in the past. I, I personally don't mind the collaborations uh, with Marvel and other other brands. Um, I think it's not a big deal. If anything, I think it's actually. Oh my god, this guy's flying around me. So some people have been like expressing concern about like, oh, you know, we want Fortnite skins or whatever. Uh, if you want my personal opinion, I am actually excited about these collaborations. Like at, at the end of the day, like I don't really have a huge attachment to the Fortnite, you know, battle passes and the idea of getting more like real superheroes in Fortnite, more collaborations, Marvel, DC, and whatever else is to come in the future. Like I'm a fan of that. I don't really mind that at all. Um, some people do, and I understand why, you know, like you can have your own opinion on this. 
It's just my opinion. Don't mind the fact that they're doing more Marvel and uh, superhero themed stuff. Um, but you, you, you know, you're free to have your own opinion. If you just want to know my opinion, that's that's what I'm talking about. Um, there's also a rumored new fish, a rare fish that's coming next season. All right. Uh, this is going to be a Midas fish. It's not it's not the mythic fish. OK, it's not the mythic fish. This is going to be some cool, some sort of gold flopper that's coming next season. It's going to be a rare pickup. Um, rumored to be not as rare as the mythic goldfish, which is like one in a million. It's going to be rare, but not that rare. And what it's going to do, allegedly what it's going to do is if you eat it, your entire inventory will turn gold. So all your guns will turn gold. And uh, I'm assuming your heels will be untouched, but it seems to be like an instant gold upgrade for everything that you're yet you have in your inventory. So that'll be interesting to see if that actually is true. If that's going to make the game, how rare is it going to be? Is it going to be one in 10,000 like the golden mushroom? Is it going to be one in a million like the mythic goldfish? Or is it going to be like one in a hundred? Something that happens every once in a while. Um, so we'll have to see. I'm interested in, in finding out more about this, uh, this gold Midas fish. It should be a very interesting addition to the game. My man was actually shooting back. As we talked about in the past, guys, we we've covered that the, there's probably going to be a huge fishing update next season. Uh, we've, we've already seen a lot of different fishes in the game files, a lot of different uh, fish audio noises, uh, thermal floppers, fire floppers, hop floppers, different colors. Season four is probably going to have a huge emphasis on these new fish. Um, and now with the information about the Midas fish, the gold Midas fish, this kind of confirms uh, our belief that there will be a huge fishing update next season. Also, we have a leak about the Joker. So this is not Marvel. This is DC. Uh, November 17th, rumored for there to be a Joker pack releasing um, with the Midas skin as well. So Midas is not dead. We thought the shark ate him, but clearly he's still around looking to make a comeback and we'll probably see more of him in the future seasons. Like I said, it's rumored that the Thor versus Galactus is going to be the season four event. As for season three, there has been no confirmed leaks or any information about an event happening in season three. We do see the spaceship event happening earlier uh, this month, and there is going to be a high tower rift above Caddy before the end of the season. But we're not 100% sure if there's going to be a big season event at the end of season three. So since we're unsure as to what's going to happen uh, with the mythic weapons and POIs next season, there is a theory that the superheroes that are coming in the battle pass, the Marvel superheroes, will each have their own mythic POI and mythic weapon. Um, mythic POIs has been a bit of a weird issue because of the fact that since there's only three mythic POIs in the map right now, everyone pretty much lands at a mythic POI um, and a lot of the lobby dies out as a result as people try to go for the kit launcher and shotgun and the grappler. And to finish it off, uh, Mark Rain, Epic President, he, somebody asked him, okay, Mark, if you could use a word to describe the upcoming season, what would you say? And he replied, superb. Now, Mark has not really leaked anything in the past. This could just be his way of describing the season, but his choice of word, superb, considering that this is rumored to be a superhero season, is pretty... It's, it's a pretty big coincidence uh, for that to be the word of choice, um, having all these information about superheroes being in the next season. So take that with a grain of salt. It could mean nothing. It could be absolutely nothing. Or it could be a small little hint uh, or wordplay on what the next season is going to be about. It's coming in a week. And if you guys want to find out everything about season four when it comes out, of course, we're going to have our patch videos and our update videos on this channel. So if you're not already subscribed, if you're not already like this video, go ahead and do that. I'll see you guys next time in the next video. Thank you guys so much for watching.